What's good, YouTube? You can't go out here and I'm back again with another fire video. And today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make your very own custom video links for your video players. And also how to combine those same links and turn them into your very own custom video playlists. All right, before we start the video, there's a couple things you're gonna need. One is an application called Notepads. It should already be downloaded on your PC. Therefore, it's a default application. Go to the bottom left of your screen and you wanna type in notes. It shows it right here, so we're gonna click on it. And if you already have a note that's up, just create a new one by clicking file and press new tab. All right, the second thing you're going to need is a video player. I'm using the Pro TV in this video. If you want to learn how to get the Pro TV and set that up, there's a video on my channel. Just click the link in the description and just come back to the video. All right, now that we're done covering what we need, we can now get started with the steps. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the top right of my screen and click on the circle so I can get rid of all the extra stuff. Now make your way to the notepad and we're going to make some links. All right, so there's two things you're going to need to remember when you're formatting your links. One is spaces and second is symbols. Every video starts with an at and then the link of your choice and then press enter on your keyboard. And in the second space, you're gonna put the name of your video. Like if I were to put Batman. Now with that being said, when you have completed these requirements, you have completed one video. Now let's say you want multiple videos, right? What you would do is go to the end of the title, which is the end, and then press enter on your keyboard and then press it one more time. Then you can start a new link. Always make sure there's a space between each and every video. And just a quick tip, if you got a lot of songs and videos and you want this to go faster, just copy what you have already by selecting over the text and pressing Control and C on your keyboard and then create the space for the next video and press Control and V. Do the same thing and then you can keep copying the format over and pasting more. But for this video, I'm only gonna do three links. All right guys, now that we're done learning how to format, we can now learn how to build the playlist. All right, so make your way to YouTube and let's just find three videos. So I'm gonna hover over the videos that I want. I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna turn them into new tabs. Let's do both of these blade ball videos and let's do one 2K video. Now you want to go to the top left of your screen, you want to copy this whole link. And you can do that by hovering over the URL, left clicking it, and then pressing Ctrl and C on your keyboard. Make your way back to your notepads, go to in front of the app, and then press Ctrl V on your keyboard. I'm going to name this video $50, and I'm going to go ahead and import the other links from the other videos as well. I'll see you guys when that's done. Alright guys, now that we're back, the links are done. Now what you want to do is you want to go to File, and you want to Save As. Send it to wherever you can get it, and you want to make sure the encoding is set to UTF-8. Now make your way back to your Unity scene. You want to open up your file explorer, go to where you put it, take that playlist, and you want to drag it into your assets library. Now, after you are able to confirm that the playlist is in your assets, go to the top left of your screen where the video player is. We'll click on the drop down, click on the drop down of room, click on the drop down of composite UI, click on the drop down of animated, click on the drop down of playlist Q drawer, and once you get here, you want to click on playlist. Now, make your way to the right side of your screen, and you want to scroll all the way down. You see where it says video playlist items. You want to drag and drop your video playlist into the box on the right. Once you have that in there, you want to make sure load from text file is checked. If it's not checked, then check it on. And then you want to click import. The names of your videos should show up on the screen. If it doesn't, that's just fine. It'll show up in the test. The most important thing to make sure is that your video show up in this bottom area right here. Oh yeah, guys, one more important thing that I almost forgot. You see where it says autofill format? You want to put in dollar sign URL. This allows you to import for Quest users along with PC at the same time. All right, so let's make our way to the SDK. If you guys see this, just click auto fix and it'll go away. I'm going to press build and test and I'll see you guys in the test server. As you guys can see, the first link does work. Let's try the second link. And let's try the third one. All right. All right, guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you don't ever miss an upload if you can't go to. I'm very close to 1,000 subscribers, so every sub counts. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.